Biotechnology and Bioprocessing Center of Excellence is one of the eight centers of excellence established at Addis Ababa Science and Technology University to foster research and innovations that support national economic development. Today, we are joined by Dr. Grma Gonfa, the head of the center. My, my name is Grma, and uh, currently I'm working as uh, head for Biotechnology and Bioprocessing Center of Excellence. And uh, the center works on different areas. As you know, uh, our economy depends on agriculture. Mm -hmm. So usually we, we, we send our products in a raw form, so we need to process that one. So the bioprocess part will deal with that. And also we need to increase the productivity of the agriculture. So the biotechnology is, is, is meant to support the productivity of the agriculture. For example, in our case, we sell a raw, raw coffee, but we, we, we buy the, the import the processed one. Mm -hmm. There are many products that, that we sell the raw material, but we import it in, in a processed form. So the center was established to support such kind of activity because, uh, as I said, our economy depends on the cultural productivity. And uh, the center has uh, seven thematic areas. The first one is uh, the microbial technology, mm. where we can apply microbes to, to, to produce different products. We have also the biofood and biofeed, mm. which deal with the food items, and also animal feed. And uh, the third one is the bio, biofuel and the biochemical. Mm. Biofuel is uh, the, the type of fuel that we can produce from biomass. And also we can produce different chemicals from the biomass. So we, the, this thematic area is changing the biomass to, to different products. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have also the biopharmaceutical, where we, we produce different pharmaceutical products from the bi biomasses. Mm -hmm. So we have also this thematic area. We have also the molecular biotechnology, which, which helps the productivity of the agriculture. We have also the genomics and the bioformats, which most of these are uh, computer-based uh, uh, researches. Mm -hmm. And uh, <coughs> the center has uh, a strong uh, uh, team. Mm -hmm. We have uh, won different international and national grants. For example, when the previous Ministry of Science and Technology funded some projects, we won uh, four projects, four big projects, mm -hmm. which which is about three up to five million. So uh, from those projects, we try we try to develop the product. For example, if you know, we have the bioblocks. Mm -hmm. The bioblocks is a, is what is a product of one of the projects. So the the center tried to to develop the the pilot scale product. We have also various national and international collaboration. For example, we have strong collaboration with the MIDI, which is what mm -hmm. we call the, the um, uh, manufacturing and in the industry in the development institute. Mm -hmm. We've developed various projects with them. We have also project with chemical corporation. We have also project with sugar industry groups. So we have a strong collaboration with national and international uh, mm -hmm. institutions. Mm -hmm. And uh, we, all, we have also uh, some PhD students. We have workshop workstation for them. Mm. We actually, we don't have the strong facility for them currently because the new building is not completed, but mm. we have temporary workstation for them. And uh, we have around 25, 30 PhD students at, at our center mm. under our staff. And we are, we, we are trying to support them uh, at least for the time being. For the time being some some success stories but we have also challenges um, one of the challenges uh, our, our building is currently under construction not completed we have also limited resources because currently we are using laboratory from the department mm -hmm. from the central lab fortunately we have good laboratory at chemical engineering department mm -hmm. we have also good laboratory at food engineering laboratory we also use the biotechnology department we have we also use the central laboratory mm -hmm. laboratory but we don't have our laboratory now, so that, that's one of the challenge. And the other challenge may be the funding. There are limited funding in the country, mm -hmm. so 
We try to get the, the meter fund, but still we are struggling to get additional funds. We also want some international fund, but still there are some 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 shortages of of, of funding. So mm-hmm. this can be considered as as a limitation. But we are trying to progress with the challenge. For for the projects funded by the university, we at least we need to involve. So at least one one student in the project. So mm-hmm. we check that one. Otherwise, we don't grant the project. Mm-hmm. So in a, in a given project, at least one PhD or one master student will involve. Mm-hmm. That said, we also provide some workstation. So the student will have a place to sit in the work. Mm-hmm. So uh, we try to almost all the PhD student in in those area will involve in the project. So that at least we support financially with uh, with. Our internal project. No. We have uh, different funders. For example, we have one project from the Bioemerging Institute. Mm. We have also one international project we, which we won this year, which is about 100,000 uh, USD. Mm. And we also good collaboration with the Sugar Corporation. Some of the money will be funded by the university. Mm and that some of the support will give for, from the industry. Mm. So we have also co- collaborative projects. We have also fund projects. I think, in terms of fund, we have we have a stra- strong background in, in, in funding. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we we have a good story since mm-hmm. we started, but we need to move faster, and we need to support the university vision as well as the national vision. So we, I want to ask our ma- team members and, and, and the central excellence mm-hmm. members to come together and uh, develop uh, a big project so that we can support our, our uh, facility and we can also support the university vision and also the national vision. So I hope the management will also help us in getting the infrastructure. So I, I will ask the management to support in a such way. And uh, we need also um, a national collaboration. For example, ours is uh, biotechnology and the bio process center of We have also a national center of mm-hmm. which is about emerging. So we need to work with them also. Mm-hmm. So I will call all the stakeholders to work with us.